everybody welcome back to another youtube video so for today's video i'm going to be doing a really chill summer night routine about two days ago i came back from church camp and i loved it so much it really opened my eyes and i feel super happy and joyful um, i saw how much y'all love my summer day in life so i really wanted to do a night routine with you guys and for the past couple of days i've just been chilling at home by myself because um yesterday i felt sick i think it's because my allergies are really bad and today i don't know why but i've just felt like i need to be by myself so yeah i went to church this morning and it was really good um and then i went home and ate lunch and haven't really done anything since then i've been watching some of nicole's youtube videos um i don't know how to say her last name i think it's leno i don't know you'll probably know who i'm talking about she's awesome and definitely one of my favorite youtubers love her so much um and i've also been practicing guitar and um just been on my phone Relaxing. It's currently 5.09. So I'm gonna be filming like dinner and then me getting ready for bed and just me hanging with myself and having fun because it's summer and you're supposed to be outside and have fun. So that's what I'm gonna be doing. But first, I think I wanna read because um I haven't been getting in my read and I'm really in that reading mood right now. And I started this book like a month ago or like two months ago, I don't really know. And I went on a really big reading slump, so I haven't been reading. And I'm going to start back um the book i've been reading or i you know started was the seven husbands of evelyn hugo and it's been really good and i'm really excited to keep reading it more um so i'm gonna be reading that for a little while and then i will update you guys what i'm doing after that <laughs> Okay guys, it is a bit later. Um, I'm gonna be completely honest, I did fall asleep. I've read a few chapters though, and then I was feeling really tired, and I was like, I'm gonna take like a one minute nap, and that turned into like an hour nap, maybe two hours. I don't really know how long I slept. It is five, it is almost seven o'clock. Hold up, it's 6.55. So, I didn't sleep for that long, but it was good enough to get me like revived, because I did wake up early today, for church so i'd understand why i'm so tired and i've also gotten like no sleep the past couple of days but i'm kind of hungry so i need to know when we're gonna have dinner because in my family it's like all over the place no one knows when we're having dinner so i need to find out when we're having dinner because i'm hungry there's the view from my room it's like it's only seven so it's like not that dark but it looks more dark because it's like storming kind of ignore the tape smudges on my window that's kind of ugly but anyways I talked to my mom and they're planning on going to dinner about like right now. So I'm going so I'm going to change out of my dress up on all day from church. I'm probably gonna keep this sweater on because I don't wanna like rechange everything. I don't know yet. But I'm just gonna change into like some sweatpants and a more suits able, comfortable outfit to wear out to eat and I'll like meet you guys back and do like a little O T D. It probably won't be cute because I said comfortable. So Okay, so I've changed. Um, this is the same sweater I was wearing before. It is from American Eagle. And I'm not wearing anything under it besides my bralette. I don't know where it's from. Um, pants are like open-legged sweatpants from Target. And I'm probably going to end up wearing my black fake Burks from Target. So, yeah. Um, I'm going to rip it on like deodorant, perfume, whatever those type of stuff probably clean my eye ma mascara because it's everywhere but um stay tuned sorry the video is a little bit everywhere just just wait it'll be it'll be okay it's kind of the whole point that it's like supposed to be calming i guess i don't really know anyways i'm gonna you guys back in the car we are about to leave but look at the sky it's gonna be pretty even though it was storming and like raining earlier but it's gonna storm more later so Okay guys, so for dinner I have buffalo mac and cheese, buffalo chicken mac and cheese, and I have lemonade. And I have <laughs> her favorite person, her father. I have a chicken quesadilla. Okay, so we left dinner, we're at the gas station now, and I'm gonna get some candy because um, I guess we're just gonna relax for the rest of the night, and I really want candy because I've been craving candy for a really long time. So we're at racetrack.
Okay, the sun's setting right now, so it's really dark, but just left the gas station and I got these really good nerd clusters. My counselor had them at camp, so um, I tasted one and they're so good. I've been in love with them, so that's what I got. I'll meet you guys back when we get home. Hey guys, I'm back in my room. I did a really fun TikTok with my brother, so make sure to go in the description and look at my TikTok because it was a really fun TikTok to make and I literally made it myself, so make sure to go watch that. But it is currently 9.30 almost and um, I ate a lot of the candy I had. I had two packages at the clusters and I already finished one and my stomach hurt so badly. Also because that buffalo mac and cheese that I had for dinner was so good and I ate all of it, so I'm just stuffed. Um, so I'm pretty sure I'm not gonna eat for the rest of the night, but right now, I I think I'm just going to settle down. I still have to read my Bible today. I've read like some of my Bible app, I'm just like the first of the, the verse of the day, but I do need to spend some time with God today because I have done that. I've been doing that a lot more, which I'm proud of myself for, and I do not need to fall off track um, no matter how I'm feeling. So I'm going to do that. Um, but then also my clothes from earlier is in the dryer so i'm gonna take that out and then undo that and like put it in my closet and stuff so i actually think i'm gonna do that first so i'm gonna i'm gonna get my clothes from the dryer and unload it okay we've gotten the clothes and now we're going to unpack it <sighs> this load wasn't that big because i did a really big load earlier before i filmed so yeah Okay, I'm editing my video right now, and um, this little disclaimer from my phone. The clip you're about to see is me having a mental breakdown over my tote bag. And I know, I know y'all are gonna think I'm being so overdramatic, which I was, but it was in the moment, and the tote bag does have a little bit of meaning to me because I did get it at a very fun vacation, and I've used it literally every, every single day since then. So it does have some type of meaning towards it, and I do get really sensitive over that those type of things. So yeah, I was a little bit sad over it. Not a little bit, a lot, but you you know what I mean and the reason my parents and family was laughing at me isn't because they're being super mean to me or not caring for me it's because I do this all the time and it's actually kind of funny now that I rewatch it I'm laughing at myself um but just letting y'all know definitely get some laughs in because this is <laughs> this is actually hilarious guys i'm back i'm sorry i just had a whole mental breakdown because my sh my tote bag had it shrunk in the dryer and it's i have like an emotional attachment to it <sighs> i got it from earthbound it's the cutest thing ever y'all have definitely seen it i bring it everywhere with me but i mean it's big dad like it's still big but it's so much tinier than it was before and i'm so disappointed but it was really dirty from camp because i brought it to camp and it shrunk oh i just cried but anyways let's let's finish <laughs> back in my laundry Okay, so the next thing I need to do, like I talked about earlier, was do a little Bible study. I have been doing this a really a lot recently because I think it's really important to open your Bible and read it because it makes you feel so much more happier than just like not reading your Bible. You don't you don't know the effect the Bible has on you until you open it up and read it. So I really recommend if you don't do it because it does change people and um listening to the words that God has to tell you is something that will change your whole mindset on things. Um even though I just kind of read so bad but you know what I mean and I'm going to right now I'm studying the book of Psalms and Matthew because I just find those books so enjoyable um definitely recommend like Proverbs Romans Ecclesiastes those books are good but anyways let's get Bible studying
Okay, so sorry about the lighting change. It's getting a little dark in here, but I just finished my little Bible study for tonight. I read Psalms 13, 14, and 15, and um, I finished up Matthew 21 because I had stopped because I was like halfway done with it at camp because I read a little bit on my bible when i was not doing anything because i wanted all the distractions to be gone so i rarely went on my phone um but i enjoyed that in matthew right now i'm learning about the parables which i love learning about them so interesting and um it's cool like giving those stories because it just makes me like you know cool and i also love the colors that i put in my bible it makes me want to read the bible a lot more definitely recommend if you're having a trouble if you're having trouble reading the bible um either find a chapter that's real fun and has real fun stories in it or um put some color or just do things that you would enjoy and would make you want to read the bible more because it can be a very hard thing to do like i could say that personally um but it's definitely a very good thing to do and once you start doing it it's pretty hard to not do it anymore yeah but now i have nothing else to do so i'm probably gonna actually start getting ready for nighttime and my little actual night routine okay guys we're in the bathroom my hair looks kind of crazy because it just got out of the claw clip, so it's like molded. My curly hair girls were understand, but I'm just gonna hop in the shower, and then I'll meet you guys back when I get out, and I am ready to wash my face and brush my teeth. Okay, guys, I just got out of the shower. My tan lines are so deep, and I haven't been in the pool in so long. Actually, I went, I was outside for all of camp, and I went to the pool during camp. I'm lying to y'all right now. Okay, so now I'm done with all my skincare and my face is all clean. I also have a towel on YouTube, so please don't like block my comments because I'm wearing a towel. I'm not showing any part of my body right now, so just letting y'all know. I'm gonna I'm gonna go back in my room and change into my pajamas and then do a little outro. Okay guys, I got my pajamas on and I have my claw clip back in because my hair is all wet. Um my PJs are this pink tank top I got from Target and then these cute sweatpants short things i also got from target and that's basically it um as you can tell target is the place for me i love it there but anyways that is the end of this video i'm now probably just gonna chill in my bed until i fall asleep um but i love you all so much and i hope you guys enjoy the video today was really chill but i was pretty happy today besides the point that my toe bag shrunk i'm still thinking about that it's still a thought in my head anyways i'm sorry i'm getting really off topic but um if you want more videos make sure to comment recommendations because i have no idea what any upcoming videos are going to be so yeah but anyways i love you all so so much and hope you guys enjoyed bye